So today I'm going to show you how to use if this then that to send you a text message whenever you get a new email that uh, meets your qualifications for that text. So we're going to start with signing in. Uh, if you don't have an account, you can click sign up and you'll have the option to sign in with either Facebook, Google, or create your own login with a uh, password. It'll ask for all the information signed up. In my case, since I've already got an account, I'm going to just continue with Google. It's going to pop up a nice little window that's going to ask you to authenticate, which I did off screen. It'll ask you to log in with Google if I go the route that I did. So log me in. So if you're new, it's going to walk you through a little bit. You'll get past that. And then what you'll do is you'll come to My Applets, you'll click New Applet and then you'll uh, click this. So what this is saying, if this happens, then the next thing will happen. So we're going to click this. And in my case, we're using Gmail. So I'll click Gmail. Um, and first time you do it, you're going to have to authenticate. So it's going to ask you to connect to your account. And you'll just click Connect. You'll log in. You'll allow if this, then that to run through your email service and uh, go from there. Um, now, if this then that works with Gmail and Outlook, um, if you're using another type of email system, um, you should probably get on Gmail. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to choose um, really any of the ones that you that you would actually want to specifically receive one for for uh, a text for. Um, so we're going to say in my in this case, since I don't want to receive a text for every single new email. Um, let's just say a new email inbox from from me. So so we'll enter the email the email, and of course you don't have to do it this way. You can pick any of the any of the other ones. Just read through what they do, and it'll tell you exactly. Um, so we'll click create trigger. So now we got Gmail in there, so the next one is going to be that, and this one is going to be SMS. And what this does is it allows you to get important notifications on your phone via, via SMS um, or text message, and it'll allow you to do up to 100 messages per month. Um, so if you get more than 100 texts or 100 emails per month that you're going to want text messages for, um, there's another way to do that, assuming you've... Uh, got the app on your phone which I can cover in another video where you can reach out to me. Uh, so you'll want to click connect. It's going to open this. It's going to ask you to verify your phone number. So I'll do so then you're going to click send pin. It's going to text you a pin. Um it is taking forever to come through on my end. <clears throat> oh, no wonder. I missed it. So try that again. Send pin. You'll get the new pin. You'll get, you'll get the pin on your phone as a text. You'll type it in. And then you'll click connect. Now what it'll let you do is click send me an SMS. And then right here you'll get the option to have it uh, tell you what the SMS is. So this is the body of the text that you're going to get whenever you get the email that matches that search. Um, so right now it's set as saying, it's going to say Gmail from, it's going to show the from address of whoever sent you the email. Um, and then it's going to show the subject subject line. You can change this around reword using the add ingredient, and these will pull from the email that you received. And then you click create action, and that's pretty much it. You just got to click finish, and it's on. And that's all you got to do.